Welcome to the Design Clans podcast. In the last episode, we spoke about seeing your future, and I also promised that uh, in this episode we are going to talk about one of the most important phase in your business. This is where everything begins, my friend. In today's episode, you will learn how to simplify the process of setting your goals. I'm Santosh, the founder of Design Clans, and the vision of Design Clan is to help people design their future by helping them create and grow their business on the internet. If you've worked in an MNC or a corporate environment, you might have come across this term which is called uh, smart goals. I'm not going to get very corporate on you. I don't even know if corporate is a word actually, but you know what you know what I mean. My goal is to simplify your goal setting process. I will use the smart goal strategy a little bit, but I will also help you set up your goals without complicating it too much. If you want to know what smart goals are all you have to do is open google and look for smart goals you will find a lot of articles on it great articles in the front page itself you will find it you can use this strategy to set up goals as well this is what most of the successful businesses across the world do they follow this process in goal setting however here in design clans i have simplified the entire process of goal setting in four easy steps so make a note it's critical for your success here is step number 1 understand what you really really want okay you're going to have two kinds of goals here one is your long term goal this is what you always dreamt of or you always wanted in your life right make a note of that and when i say long term goals i'm not talking about you know 20 30 years from now i'm talking about maybe 5 to 10 years within that and then you have the short term goal short term goal is in the next 3 to 6 months these are the goals you are going to achieve within a uh, a short span of time don't worry about how you are going to achieve it all right just be clear about what your goal is going to be long term goal and your short term goal may be write it down in a piece of paper and make sure you look at it every single day all right when you do that something amazing is going to happen your brain is a problem solving machine and it is one of the most powerful supercomputer in the world when you're looking at your goals right every single day you it's it's a problem in front of you right you have to solve it and when you're showing it to your brain or your mind every single day it will start looking for solutions you will start getting ideas when you're going through articles when you're going through your regular day there will be ideas which will pop up pop into your mind all you have to do is continue looking at your goals every single day and continue to build your business okay don't lose focus there what is going to happen is your brain will be constantly looking for solutions on how to achieve these goals and while you're building your business your mind will start giving you ideas strategies on how to achieve your goals as you go through there has to be work done you will be working towards your goals if you sit and do nothing and you not even look at your goals every single day then nothing is going to happen it's magical try it out and uh, see your mind in action that was step number 1 step number 2 is tracking your progress i use google sheets to track my progress you can use whatever you want you can use a notebook you can use google sheet or any tool that you would like to use but start tracking what's going to happen is few months from now when you look back at your tracker right you will be amazed and proud looking at how much you have progressed and progress is always good than doing nothing and i believe you're not one of those entrepreneurs who wants to do lot of things in life but does nothing about it who only sits and dreams and strategizes and thinks about it but does not put any action in it i know you're not that step number 3 keep your goals real be real and let it be relevant you understand what i mean here right your goals must be realistic for example 6 months from now you're going to earn a thousand dollars or maybe 1 lakh indian rupees this is doable it is realistic if you put your heart and mind into it but if you say i am going to make more money than jeff bezos or bill gates that is unreal it's not possible in the next 6 months So don't have unrealistic expectation 
it is not good i have gone through that experience i have i had set unrealistic expectations in the past and whenever i have not achieved it it has demotivated me a lot make sure you don't set it okay because for whatever reason if you don't achieve it in the next 6 months right you're going to get demotivated and you will probably get back to what you were doing or your regular life is going to take over and you're going to forget about building your business on the internet your business will anyway go downhill but it's also going to affect your personal life because you're never going to be happy your dream will always be there but you have now given up on your dreams don't let that happen to you lot of entrepreneurs across the world uh, you know set unrealistic expectation and they end up uh, failing that is why lot of businesses fail across the world step number 4 goals are dreams with an end date make your goals time bound and commit to that date this is your life and you are the captain of your soul only you can make things happen and you only have one life so give it your best shot and once you have set your goals don't stop at anything till you achieve it so make sure you write down your goal date if you're saying 6 months from now be specific what date before which date are you going to achieve that goal write that down next to your goal same with your long term goal and look at your goals and dates every single day and every single day your goals and date should remind you what you are supposed to do and work towards achieve it and things will happen and these are the four steps you can call this as one customized version of the smart goals but it's going to help you a lot trust me on that In the next episode you will learn about the next important phase which is discovering your superpowers. I hope you got a lot of value out of this podcast. If you have any comments reach me through any of my social media channels. And uh, if you like my podcast make sure you subscribe to it through any of these uh, platforms. I'm available in iTunes, Spotify, Google Podcast and uh, few others as well. And that's all for today. So don't forget to set your goals and start working towards it. You will hear me soon in the next podcast. This is Santosh here from Design Clans and have a wonderful day.